Okay, I'm going to try and explain the uh, burrito roll the yuppie duvet thing um, using something a bit more small scale. Well, small scale doesn't matter. Um, what matters is that the duvet cover is transparent, so I've uh, got a sandwich bag, a bit of paper, which will be my duvet. Um, first thing is I need to turn this inside out. So once I've done the thing, I'll be able to do it up. Right. Okay, next. Uh, I need a piece of paper the same size as my duvet cover. Um, normally buy it the other way around, don't you? The same size as your duvet. Okay, and in case it helps, I'm going to draw side a on one side and the side um, what looks different B looks sufficiently different B on the other side okay so what I do is I've got my inside out duvet cover and put now side B is currently up put that on top of my duvet cover and roll it up from the uh, side that doesn't have an opening. Just roll it up. Okay. Marvel is side A is now the only one visible. Um, and now I need to start turning itself around itself. So I'm going to do that. Pull that around. Pull that around there. Help to do this up so that my duvet doesn't escape in amongst all the unrolling. Uh, now, when you're doing this with a real duvet, it helps that textiles are a bit more stretchy than paper and plastic. Uh, there we go, there's one. Ah, right, okay. Now, okay, A is on the outside, there it is. I'm going to try and find in amongst itself some bits to unfurl. So there's no reason this shouldn't work. There's a bit of crumpling because when you curve a, a flat thing round, um, you need a bit more space. Uh, that's a terrible explanation, but. <laughs> So you can see where some of the topology comes in. I mean, I was hoping that this stuff would be stretchy. Uh, right, so I've unfolded it. Like that. Okay. Here's where my significant other gives me complete shouting to because the corners haven't matched up. It's really hard to make sure that happens when you're doing this method. Um, but there you go, I've revealed uh, on the other side of side A was side B. Um, and there's my finished duvet. Anyway, there you go.